Guys, you're not gonna believe this. It finally came. So welcome back to the shop. My name is Ryan, this is McKinley Design Studio, and uh, this is a very special edition of unboxing at the shop. In October of 2016, I took my hard-earned money and went to an inner website called anovos.com. They were selling a new, uh, the Force Awakens Stormtrooper Armor Kit with helmet for $750, which is a really good deal. Uh, it was not their first introduction. They'd done the first introduction in 15 to some people in the 501st and the stuff looked great. And so I thought I'd pull the trigger. And uh, then what happened was Disney made The Last Jedi Rise of Skywalker, they built two Disneyland Star Wars parks, they made the Book of Boba Fett, three seasons of The Mandalorian, uh, they finished Clone Wars, they did the Bad Batch, and during all of that time, Anovos was not able to deliver the one thing that I had paid them money for. Actually, there's two things. Six months prior to that, in April, I ordered the Kylo Ren outfit with the helmet and the, uh, the, the soft goods, the clothing. And guess what? Haven't seen that yet. In the process, the world went through an entire global pandemic, and we've come back on the other side of that victorious. And in the meantime, Anovos was acquired by Ruby's 2 LLC, and uh, started a, uh, a company called De Nuo Novo. De Nuo Novo. And De Nuo Novo from the get-go in 21 said, we're gonna honor all of Novos' things. And so two years later with me sending emails, when am I getting my stuff? When am I getting my stuff? When am I getting my stuff? Finally, they said, well, we sent out an email asking for your address and you didn't send it. So I sent him my address. And today, in May of 2023, I have received my Stormtrooper helmet. Now, there's a kit that's coming separately, I hope soon, but after almost seven years, I guess it's been six and a half years for this thing, I finally have something to show for it. So we're gonna open it up today. So let's do this. Uh, I am so excited to have this helmet in my hand. So let's take a look, see what it looks like. Big cardboard thing, it says Star Wars. A first order Stormtrooper helmet accessory, officially licensed. Now over the years I've been asking, just I just want my stuff. And uh, I've heard people even when Anobos was in business tried to get their, tried to get their money back and they had a hard time even trying to get their money back. So let's take a look at this. Okay, here it is. down just so it doesn't get scratched up. So here we go, guys. Here is the long awaited piece. So first impressions. Okay, so the box says that it's injection molded. So this is not like ABS. And uh, there it is, really bare bones. It's got a helmet uh, liner or like a, like a forehead stabilizer on the inside which is pretty cool, I guess. It's better than nothing. Uh, a lot of the Novos helmets sometimes have just come with, it's just padded, very similar to how uh, the master replica stuff or the EFX stuff was. Um, it's got the little tabs on it. These little holes are vents, which is kind of cool. Instead of like painted on, you can see through them. Let's see how easy it is to put on. Let's see, this is gonna probably have to open up a little bit. It's gonna have to open up a little bit more. Oh, I'm tightening it up. Nope, I'm not.
there we go. It's on. Okay, so first impressions. Finally, it's here. I know in Novos, I think in Novos was still pulling these pieces like they were vacuum formed. So the injection molding thing is, is pretty awesome. It does have that injection molded look, but I can see that there's definitely different parts. Um, I'm gonna compare this to the Hasbro one in just a second, but what I can see from the get-go is there's no like seam lines here where it's multiple pieces that's come together, at least on this part. You can see this, there's a seam here. So this lower lip goes here and then they've really hidden the fact that this is a second piece and then this is all a third piece. But uh, I mean, all in all, it's light and it looks like it's gonna be just amazing for trooping. Um, and honestly, like a Novos, they were pumping these things out for Disney parks. Like the stormtroopers that you see in Disney parks, a Novos made that. So they were using us to get that license to do that for them. You know, we were the seed money for that. And it's just so messed up. But let me get, let me get the, uh, what is it? The Hasbro Black Series. Let's compare. Okay, so here we go. So can you tell which one is the Anovos and which one is the Hasbro? So we got Hasbro here and we have the Denuo Novo here. So first, first glance, just off of both of them, you can see that the coloration is a little different. This is a little bit more cream colored. This is a very stark white. Um, let's see. So you can see here that this is a sharper angle than here. These pieces protrude less on the Denuo Novo. There's black backing behind the Hasbro, whereas the Denuo Novo is open for ventilation, which I kind of like, because that's going to mean we're going to be able to do some, uh, some venting there. Okay, turning these onto the side. So these are obviously a little different because this is a button. You can press a battery and it has it kind of amp up with something. Um, these are a little different. These are very angular and these are smooth. And the little spaces up in top here, there's a gap behind each of these. I'll be honest, I don't know which of the, those are more accurate. Um, you know, the eyes look really similar, so does the brow. I mean, those look pretty, pretty much the same, but these have a little bit more of a curviness to them. Just like it's a little bit, uh, a little bit thicker on that curve. Oh, that's interesting. So here I'll get, I'll get a little closer so you can see that. Hang on. So if you look here, you can see that the metal. I don't even know what you would call that that little metal piece on the Hasbro is shiny. And then the one on the Anovos, Duo, the new Anovo, it looks more like it's aluminum. That looks more like it's like vacuum formed plastic. And then of course the inside of the Hasbro has all the like fake mechanism stuff, uh, but it's actually more heavy as a result. Um, so we'll set that aside. Okay, honestly, it looks like in construction, you can't see all of the construction in the Hasbro, but I'm thinking that it's probably, man, I wish I could pull that back. I'm willing to bet that it's almost exactly the same file that they used, um, or, or at least the same way to put it together. So we're gonna set that aside. So anyway, so, uh, giddy as a schoolgirl right now. I finally have it. That means the promise of the kit is on its way. I know. Okay, 
So I'm gonna set this one aside for a minute. So honestly, I am as giddy as a schoolgirl. Uh, really happy to get it. Was it worth seven and a half years? I mean, let me tell you what's happened in my life since then. When I bought this, I was 43 years old and now I'm 50, I just turned 50. So like seven good years of like kitten in a stormtrooper costume is, is like gone. I'll never get those years back. So, I mean, I don't know, like, I don't understand how the Disney Corporation allowed Novos to take advantage of people using their license as a, just a stone cold Ponzi scheme. Um, class action lawsuits have been brought up against Novos, and uh, I, I tried to get in on that, but guess what? There weren't enough people in Oklahoma to, to justify adding me to that lawsuit. They, I think it was like California and Florida and Georgia and maybe New York uh, were the only people that were allowed in on that class action. So, um, I mean, and honestly, I just wanted my part. I just wanted my piece. I just wanted my costume. So um, I've got it now and I'm really happy about that. And uh, I can't wait to see the kit and to start working on that. So uh, for now, thank you so much. Please like and subscribe and share. Um, I just, uh, I love making these videos and uh, love knowing that people get to see them. So thanks so much. See you next time at the shop. Appreciate you. Great job, Ryan. That's another good video. Just really did a good job. There's no way. My first order stormtrooper costume kit. <laughs>